Hey guys, welcome back to Rudder Innovations where today we're gonna be swapping out a glass window pane. Here we go. The problem with this existing pane is that it is actually plexiglass. So whoever owned this home before didn't go get a piece of glass, they put plexiglass in. So we're gonna remove this and put a glass pane in its place. The plexiglass came out with ease and there was no danger of breaking glass or getting cut. But if you have a broken window like this other window we replaced, you'll need to use caution when removing the glass. Now that we have the plexiglass piece out, we're gonna peel all of this caulk off so we can have a clean surface to adhere the new glass to. We scraped everything using this five-in-one paint scraper and a razor blade. And now whatever residue is left, we're gonna wipe it off with some alcohol and a rag. The paint scraper and the razor blade work well, but using a flathead screwdriver was by far the best tool I used to remove the existing caulk. Whatever residue was left behind was easily removed with the rubbing alcohol. If you're concerned about damaging or scratching the frame, you can always use a plastic scraper. All right, so we finished getting all the caulk off and using the alcohol to wipe down the frame. Now we're gonna use some soapy water and wipe down the frame and the border of the glass and then we'll come back and rinse it with regular water. I wanted to make sure everything was completely clean so that the caulk would bond properly to both the frame and the glass, which is why I went through a, such a rigorous process of cleaning it with multiple different substances. All right, so what we're gonna do, they have this little piece of rubber it's not even an eighth of an inch thick. We're gonna put this on the bottom of the windowsill for the glass to rest on. And then we're gonna put our glass on that after we caulk around it. All right, this is the caulk that we're gonna be using. It is quad OSI and the color is white, which we're also gonna be using for the glazing because the glazing uh, you cannot get anymore. Um, so just keep that in mind when you're taking it off, if you're, when you're taking off any glazing, this one didn't have any on there. Um, but just keep that in mind to be easy with it and not break it because you might not be able to get a replacement. When installing the glass, slip one side in first and as long as it's cut to the correct dimensions, the rest should fit right in. All right, we have the glass in there. I did put a little extra shim underneath to push the glass up so it would cover, um, have equal coverage all the way around. And now what we're gonna do is caulk around the border of this to create glazing. All right guys, that's how you successfully replace a pane of glass in a window. If you have any questions, you can comment below. If you like it, like it, please subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Peace and God bless.